here's one of my uh, my more recent ones. I wrote this one here for just yesterday. It's called the Utopia of Ash. And it's just a little bit of a backstory. Ash is somebody that I'm going to meet for the first time. I've known her for about a month now, and we'll be meeting for the first time here on Sunday. Digressing slowly, slowly fading from my mind, the current scene, replaced in kind by a different view, scene of thoughts unbidden and yet remarkably true. The scenery so pleasant, a face which smiles unendingly, the freshness of solid state eternity, a distant voice fading in and out, with an unfortunate and filmography of a myth like utopia is so pleasant, so pleasant. And such the pleasantness that I, I cannot break from it. These imaginings are welcoming, and though they cloud my mind and I, there is no fear at the lost clarity, for such sensation serves to guide the, mob, the body of a body such as mine, which submits a true heart to the passages of time. Thank you. And uh, the last thing I'll read today is a, it's a formula of spoken word. Something I've only recently come across within the last year here. It's, it's a rather contemporary form. I don't have a name for it. Uh, here it is. Walls brought up by the forces of man seclude him within his own skin, casting out the root at the expense of all the good laying forsaken and dying on the ground. Sometimes these walls find their foundation in the skin, meant to keep ourselves together, but oftentimes dividing is so long that it seems like forever. Meanwhile, others argue the meanings of words, and this debate over the definition's arbitrary application is simply the collective recognition that perception is key. So to truly argue with another, one must first see as the other, lest he cast stones blindly. Within these battered but unbroken bastions of mankind's stupidity lies the secrets of a fashion often quoted seldom heated, and remarkably simple. The best defense is a good offense. The secrets we keep are the weapons of our enemy, and they will use them in the last minutes of our darkest hour, fearless, because they know we are defenseless. Casting away these trappings, entrapment lies, and removing all disguises so that we may know ourselves, others may know ourselves, and ourselves will have grown accustomed to discrimination and hate, but fate is a funny thing. For most of those that truly know another, seldom hate them, seldom fear them, because honesty is trust and love, and that truth given unto us from above is the selfless love of caring, the sharing of minds and the preparing of something none other than another web plot coding of a secret, of a lie. This is the truth of true love. Thank you. So this is getting kind of late. I'm going to go into people who uh, <coughs> haven't been up yet. So uh, next up is going to be Reese. Okay. Not the fault. Uh, social security to discuss something lost. Thank you for calling Social Security. Please wait for the next available agent or age in which Social Security will be a genuine statement and certainly not on hold. Hold out your hand. This is a handout and it will be detested by your neighbors as communistic. Do not be deterred. They have also been on hold for ages and it wears the mind circuits of good citizens thin. But think of the new world after this call, brave and new, shining like magnesium in your palms that there by God. And you have blessed this land, a body unlike other bodies. They're strangely made of the same minerals and the same 70% water. In this sphere, it is advised that you all stop, you and yours, putting, pulling atoms in half through the glow, though the glow is brilliant, but inside you, instantly, the tiny body's nuclei and the thin skins are wild with agency. Either it is to kill everything in sight, everything that moves, including yourself, starting from the inside as if introspection, or it is to reproduce, fornicate, self-split into more cells until there are so many that the whole must die. All of this, it's a kind of agency, you think, or it is also called cancer, but that is not our concern. Despite the disease, you must hold your place in mind for the next available agent who can show you what true agency is in a society of atomic security. <laughs> <laughs> 